The AF area mode setting determines whether the focus point is selected automatically or manually. This setting is available in all of the exposure modes. You can select it from the information display or the custom settings menu. To access this feature through the custom settings, press menu and navigate to the pencil icon. Press the right arrow or OK to open the menu. Navigate to the autofocus submenu and press the right arrow or OK again. Custom setting A1 controls AF area mode. Press OK to access the AF area options. The default AF area mode is auto area for most of the exposure modes. In this setting, the camera will look for faces, objects close to the lens, or groups of objects in the center of the frame to choose an appropriate focus point. For many instances, this may be okay, but by changing the AF area mode, you can gain more control over the end results. We will begin with single point. Just as we described earlier with the close-up and sports modes, you can use arrow keys to choose any one of 11 focus points. If you select single point while in P, S, A, or M, the camera will apply this setting to all of the advanced exposure modes. Next, change the AF area mode setting to dynamic. On the information display, you will still see the bracket indicating that you can select the focus point. But now, it is surrounded by plus signs representing the other 10 focus points. These focus points are always active, so in Dynamic Area AF, the camera focuses on the subject behind your selected focus point. If the subject moves, the other focus points are still active. They take over, allowing the camera to maintain focus on your subject. Finally, there is 3D tracking. This option is similar to Dynamic Area AF. However, the selected focus area in the viewfinder will change as the subject enters a new area of the frame. It essentially follows your subject. This setting can be especially useful when framing subjects along the rule of thirds lines. Focus on the subject in the center of the viewfinder. Keep the shutter release half pressed and reframe your subject. Because the focus point moves, you can verify that your subject is still in focus before you take the shot. Just taking control of this one setting and deciding where you want the camera to focus will result in consistently better photographs.